Hello everyone. So today is a Sunday and it's a Sunday after a disaster what happened last week. Um, and Didi is going to uh, get delisted from uh, uh, New York and moving to Hong Kong Stock Exchange. And uh, this is a leading a, a major crackdown on all Chinese uh, stocks. And, and I know it's uh, also um, for a, uh, it's a, a bad news to Yuxin UXIN. And for the people who are still here, um, I guess just keep calm and um, who are here are are really tough guys and uh, you are um, you know much more about this company and the whole market and I don't think I need to address more about um, the potential of this company UXI and Yuxin and because uh, after all the sell-off and you guys are still here and um, I don't think everyone knows the reason of uh, uh, the delist of uh, Didi. Uh, Didi um, came to the U.S. for um, in June uh, 2021, and in the, the, in that time, um, the Chinese government has already issued a um, restriction, which is trying to uh, do a more uh, security uh, check on those uh, tech co tech company um, who's a uh, um, IPO overseas, and because those company are um, they are uh, they were holding more uh, tons and tons of uh, um, security information data, uh, which is a a key. Um, it's a it's it's um, the which is the the central government the Chinese central government would was a really uh, concerned about and uh, a the Chinese government uh, back then already issued a ban not totally ban because uh, some other companies are uh, they are still able to uh, came to the U.S. for IPO but for DD which is uh, a a key company holding security data. And the government, the Chinese government, doesn't want, didn't want to uh, the company DD overseas um, IPO, uh, but DD still did it um, for some reason. Uh, either the uh, the capital want to uh, really cash out, or some other reason. I don't know, but they did it uh, in a low key. Um, and no one went to ring the bell at um, in New York, and um, so the Chinese government was shocked, and uh, imme immediately um, took more actions on this company. They stopped uh, the the new download of uh, Didi's application, and Didi's business was uh, was uh, um, significantly um, impacted. Um, so they lose a uh, lose a lot of uh, market share, market share, and a lot of uh, small like a uh, um, DD's competitor um, just um, came up and uh, tried to steal all the market shares, and in the long run, DD couldn't do that uh, without losing this many uh, market shares. And so after six months, the company decided to, um, you know the story, decided to um, uh, leave the U.S. and go to Hong Kong. Um, um, on the news over here in the States, and you see a lot of uh, news was saying, oh, DD the deal is still going to uh, lead uh, more companies like uh, um, Alibaba, um, Neil, uh, do the same thing. Um, 
and uh, I guess that's also for other small companies, and um, including UXI and Yuxing. In three years, uh, they still have three years to um, comply with uh, uh, the U.S. rules, U.S. Uh, uh, regulations. Uh, to my opinion, um, I personally, I don't think all the companies, uh, all the Chinese companies, gonna get delisted uh, just because of the uh, DD. Mm. The reason is simple. I mean, w right now we are in a global. Um, economy and no one can stop the globalization of the uh, the market and back back then uh, like 10 years ago 20 years ago when Google was kicked out of the China's come market no one think no one thought oh, uh, the Microsoft gonna leave uh, HP doll all the Western uh, multinational company gonna leave because it didn't happen it's just uh, a, a specific case for Google and the same time for DD2. This is a, a, a special case and this is a company uh, it has a has a very crucial key data of uh, Chinese uh, citizens and some key persons like a travel and data they couldn't the Chinese government will not give to the um, the out, outside in this, this there are these concerns. It relate to the the security safety of uh, the Chinese citizen, Chinese uh, of government. It's just uh, a a no no for uh, releasing this data. So um, for the people here of Yuxin uh, uh, UXIN, and um, we see a. Uh, a dramatic drop of uh, this this um, company and um, and um, the people who are still here. I mean, they're. I mean, we are we are still here, and we we see this company goes up and down, and it's uh, it's just no big deal. And and after all, we are investing this in this um, company, not just buying stocks, right? And uh, we see the value of this company. So um, that's just you know, my dear, uh, I my ideas of uh, uh, today. Uh, hope uh, good things are gonna happen uh, in the short term, right? Um, take care. Bye.